course, I'm sorry that things turned out the way they did, but they wouldn't have turned out the way they did if I hadn't done what I did. And I'm very sorry for doing what I did. And I'm sorry for all of the pain that I've caused, and I wish that I could change all of that. I wish I could take all of that away from them and take it on to myself. I remember feelings, and one of my feelings that I remember that was most prominent was severe mortal terror. And I don't know if that explains why things happened the way they did, but um, it was definitely fight or flight. Um, I'm as prepared as I can be, I guess, in a situation like this. I'm not anticipating it or expecting it, um, but if it comes, then that's a bridge I'll just have to cross. So if it happens, I'm going to feel really bad for what I've done to my family in addition to all the pain I've already caused because I think that'll just cause more pain. Um, and I don't think it'll give closure to anyone because what will happen if I get a death verdict is it will drag on and on and on through appellate courts for years instead of just getting this thing done and over with and sending me off to prison and forgetting about me. Well, I think that I deserve, um, if I get life, I deserve to have a second shot at freedom someday because I know I'd be very responsible with it.